Have you ever been convicted of a felony? Um, felony, so, no, sir. You've never been convicted of a felony? No, uh, Ever? Um, it's been 14 plus years. Sir. Yeah, but have you ever been convicted of a felony? Um, ever in your life? Yes. Okay, then you're a convicted felon. You cannot possess a firearm. That, uh, sir, that's not mine. That's somebody that left it uh, probably in my back seat, sir. Okay. We're going to go back here, okay? Right. Nowadays, it's not like back in the day. Nowadays, we have this thing called... DNA and this thing called fingerprints. Yeah, what's going on, y'all? Thank you for coming to my channel. My name is Wally, and you are now tuned into PBH TV. Hey, this is the king of melodies, B. Yo, we back with some more Law and Order Body Cam, baby. Hey, look, listen, man. This right here got to do with a guy getting busted while on his lunch break. How do you even do that? How was you able to achieve something like that? I mean, you on lunch. You ain't supposed to be doing nothing criminal. What's going on out here? All right, so let's see what this is all about. In the meantime, if you like what you see, make sure you hit that like, comment, share, subscribe, and definitely hit the notification bell. It will only help my channel grow. Let's go, baby. And all that shit out there, you're going to be like, this guy is just a straight liar. The window go down? Okay, how you doing? I'm officer here at Palm Beach Gardens Police Bar. The reason I stopped you is because your license is suspended. My, uh, my license is suspended, sir. I got a court date. I got uh, I got to meet, but like I had to renew everything before my birthday next week. <laughs> yo, this always seems to amaze me, yo. Like, if you're dirty, when I say dirty, I mean your license is suspended or you got a warrant or something. You should not be driving a car, man. You understand what I'm saying? You taking a wild chance. Like, you're asking for it. You might as well just go to the precinct and say, yo, here, I'm, I'm right here. Let's let's get this over with. You understand what I'm saying? Because this right here, man, once your license is suspended, guess what? They can run all through that car. They can do whatever they want. Do you have your license, registration, insurance, any paperwork? Yeah, yeah I got you. Where are you heading? Back to work. I was just on my lunch break. Right okay. Man. Do you have anything with your name on it? Yeah, it's on my insurance. I know, but do you have anything with your name on it? Oh, yeah. Hey, man, what's up with all the weed, bro? Uh, what's up with all the weed? All right, let's get this show started! Yeah, uh, correct me if I'm wrong. Is marijuana illegal in Florida? I know in New York, they don't even care about that anymore. But let me know, I'm not too familiar with Florida laws when it comes to marijuana. No roach I had. Is your license suspended? Just a little suspension? No, you don't have no warrants, nothing like that? No, no, no. It's, it's me waiting to go so quick that I got insurance. Oh, okay, so they'll fix it in two seconds. Yeah, that's, that's why they gave you. That's why Listen, I don't have a parent, bro. I'm not going to give you a ticket. Just put it in park, come out here, hang out right here. I'm going to go run it, make sure everything is good, make sure you don't got no warrants and shit. And then after that, we'll be out of here. Just leave the drink in here and shit, Don. Let me. Damn, he made it sound like he was about to just go right away, right? I wonder what turned the event. You got your wallet? Go ahead. Listen, man, you don't have a medical marijuana card or nothing like that? I've, I've been planning on get one. It's just I got to talk to my doctor next time I go to my doctor. Yeah, bro, get that shit, dude. It gets you out of that. This, guy, this officer here is going to hang out with you. I'm going to search your car. Okay? Yeah. Um, if it's just the weed stuff, I'm not going to arrest you. I'm not going to give you nothing. I'm not even going to give you a ticket for it. No, it was just... But... Mm. Mm, mm, mm. And we already know they're about to find the biggest prize. He's sitting calm. I know he's... I know in the back of his mind, he want to throw up. What are you taking oxys for, bro? You hurt yourself somewhere? What? Why are you taking oxys? Oh, no. That's, I, I get them off of my back. Yeah. Stop it. Get some help. That shit's a strong, bro. But the weed? No, the no, the weed is strong too. But the oxy, man, this thing's. <laughs> he said, "Nah, the weed is strong too." Me up, man. It was a, it was an accident. It was an accident I had like ten years ago with football, and then I recently had an accident. You won't believe it. These people hit us from the back, right? They hit us so hard they pushed us across the traffic. Wow. And then. They tried to run away. We had to go search them. We had to go search them um, just to even um, get them to stop, to get a lawsuit. 
One thing that he's doing way too much of is using that mouth of his. Wow. What time is it? It's uh, 12.30. 1230. Yeah, I, I, I gotta be back to work around. I gotta be back to work now. We do not care. <laughs> what do you do for a living? Yeah. What do you do? Um, I work uh, at, at, at pharmaceutical. 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 Like what really, th what made him think that that was a perfect hiding spot? I mean, I'm not condoning what he's doing, but what really possessed him to think, let me put this in the child seat. No one will ever look there. That's the first place I'm going to look if I'm looking for something. Zero. Zero. Yeah. His eyes lit up. Yeah. You already knew what that was. Stand up. Got anything else on you? Took a little bit of stop. What did they put it under the car seat? Yeah. Come on, man. Pills too in the bucket. This is Alex. I don't have a prescription for those. Even though they prescribed you a lot of oxys, bro. That's way. You know the thing that I'm confused about? I know in Florida, guns are legal, right? And let me see, what year is this from? This is 2022. I, I thought they passed a law saying that you don't need a license to carry anymore. Correct me if I'm wrong. Go in the comments and correct me if I'm wrong, all right? Let me know if this was prior to that or, or if I'm bugging out. Word. Because I thought it was legal to have guns out there. Or being that it's a gun state, I believe if you get caught with a gun, it's not as harsh as in New York. In New York, you automatically gonna do five years on your first offense. You understand me? Way too much oxy. I don't know what type of doctor would prescribe you that many oxy. Played himself. Forty three eighty five block, call for circle left. Forty three eighty five block, call for circle left. Listen. Have you ever been convicted of a felony? Um, felony, so, no, sir. You've never been convicted of a felony? No, uh, ever. Um, it's been 14 plus years. Yeah. I smell bullshit. But have you ever been convicted of a felony? Um, ever in your life? Yes. Okay. Then you're a convicted felon. You cannot possess a firearm. That, uh, sir, that's not mine. That's somebody that left it uh, probably in my backseat, sir. Okay. Yo, look, at this point, just shut up already. Let them take you to the precinct, get a lawyer, let your lawyer do all the talking. Like, there's nothing that you can say that would change the turn of events. You understand what I mean? We're going to go back here, okay? Nowadays, it's not like back in the day. Nowadays, we have this thing called DNA and this thing called fingerprints, right? That gun, you saw how I grabbed it with my gloves on? And I, wrap, and I put it literally where it is right now? It's like a process for fingerprints and then a process for DNA. Right? Based on my training experience, and the fact that I saw you slow down, look look around, and keep driving very slowly while you moved around the car. I was I was coming from the gas station. No, 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 no. I'm talking about from here, from here. When, when you saw that, I was behind you. That's when you slowed down, and you kept driving, even though I went whoop, 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 right? Because now when it comes back with your fingerprints, your DNA, and all that shit on it. Yo, homeboy is mad animated. This officer is super animated. You're gonna be like, damn, this guy is just a straight liar. Right? We don't know what he's doing. You, you feel me? It's up to you, bro. Like, I, I just, being honest with you, man. I haven't even finished yet, so I hope I don't find nothing else. Sir, uh, well, you're the arresting officer, right? Yep. Can I call somebody to come on, pick up the car from me? The better question is, is the gun yours? Is the gun mine? Like I said, be honest. Not mine. It's not yours. <laughs> but this is what baffles me with officers, right? When they say be honest. Being honest will get you nowhere. <laughs> You're going to get the most time. It's not like they're going to say, oh, he was honest. Let's give him the least time. It don't work like that, man. It's all based on politics, quotas, where they at with everything. You understand what I'm saying? So you're just risking it all. 
I say this, man. Don't even put yourself in this situation. Still going to jail for it. It's not saving you the ride whatsoever. You're going to jail for the gun today. No matter what. Because you're the only occupant in the car. The car's under your name. It's under your kid's car seat. Mm. You're a convicted felon. Mm. With drugs on you. And smoking drugs at the gas station. I was on my lunch break, boss, man. With three phones and a scale? Uh, two phones. Three? One phone don't work. It just, you know. Yeah, I may have scales that I do smoke weed. Yes, I'm not going to say I don't smoke weed. But as far as you saying, you saw me rolling the blunt, I may have been hitting a little roach that I had left on my lunch break. Yo, he's doing the most, yo. For real, all of this for a roach, yo? Seriously? You couldn't wait till you got off work and went home to do that? Okay. And he's gone. But he has the audacity to have a gun in his kid's car seat and then tell me that it's not his. Just because of that, you're getting shit told. Boss, man, I could have somebody come get it for me, man. Go for it. I could have, I probably gave somebody a ride, boss, man. They. Um, can you run it from the street? Which cars are yours? Which phone? I mean, which phone is yours? This phone is mine. These both of these? Yeah. This one's not? Yeah, I never. I bought it from Walmart. I never had a chance to activate it. He said he wants his uh, registration and stuff to go back in there. He just wants his wallet and his and his ear, he, his headphones to come with him. And he said his bill of sale for his vehicles in his glove compartment. He wants it to come with him. No, um. Right. You said you're getting it towed to the impound? Yes. Cops towing. Is there a way I can... Is there a way... We might change our mind and decide to seize it. Seize mm. it? Yeah, and forfeit it. Because mm. you're committing a felony okay. in this vehicle? Is this vehicle paid off? No, I got a... Sure? It's, it's not paid off, sir. How much you want it? Just like five more hundred dollars. Might as well be paid off. Hey, sir. <laughs> I know I go? came off at, at, on you. But nah, they're making this situation worse. Why do you got to do all that? I mean, just take them in and let somebody take the vehicle. Like, yeah, I, they doing too much now, yo. Like, they're going to forfeit it? He didn't... I can understand. I don't think they... I don't know how it works over there, but I believe in New York, you have to actually be committing a crime for them to do that or something like that. I don't know how that works, yo. That's ridiculous. Like I said, I'm no lawyer. Correct me if I'm wrong. I haven't been in these situations and don't plan on being in it anyway. I'm wrong, but I would really just get trying to get back to work, man. I'm I'm no drug dealer. I, I left that well, lifestyle. The problem is the problem is you're still trying to rub the life, you know? N not rub the, the life, sir. It's just I was just taking a smoke break before I go back to work and finish my but shit. Then why do you have a gun? I really, I, it, the gun, it got to be my homeboy who registered and he left it there. Cause I swear, if you, if, 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 if your fingerprint's going to be on it, your DNA going to be on it. Because it's not, I'm not bluffing on the DNA and fingerprint shit. Right. It's, it right. has to be processed for DNA. Right. It has to. At least when I call somebody to tow the car for me. No, I got to tow it. It's not your gun, it's not your gun. No, 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 man. No. It's getting towed no matter what. No matter what, man. I'm also taking your passport. Yeah, yeah, put it in my possession. Wow, they taking this passport? Yo, can they do this right here? Hey, go ahead and search him really quick so you can put him in there. I'll hold this stuff. This in this car has been searched. I just got it. It's a spare car. All right, if there's any drugs in here, anything like that, I'm gonna find. I'm gonna get charged with it, so you know. Basically two routes. Round one Incoming is message. you admit that it's yours if it's yours, right? You admit that it's yours. And I feel like what they're doing at this point, they they blackmailing him. It's like they're forcing him to say something because they're holding something against him. That's kind of wrong if you ask me. You know what I mean? You found what you found. Go to the precinct. Do your paperwork. Let's get this show over with. You understand what I mean? And then I just put it in his ears, it gets sent down for ballistics, and then it's done. Uh, number two is you refuse, say it's not yours, right? Then I request for a sample of your DNA. If you say no, then I have to type up a search warrant for your DNA based on what I have, right? So, like like I was, like I was explaining before, for, for the processing for the gun, right? It turns out that I need 
some some way they get DNA, so I can either get it from your consent or I have to draft a warrant. The option is up to you. Um, but based on, like I said before, the big picture, the big picture is, and, and the fact that you already told me it's yours. Um, yo, why didn't he request to speak to a lawyer? Why are they still, yo? Being that we're in 2023. Anyone who gets questions by the anybody who gets questioned by the police and you sit there and have conversations with them, like you just you shouldn't be here anymore. I'm sorry, man. We got to get rid of people like this, yo. You know, this is just one of those steps in the process that you can refuse, and then I have to apply for a search warrant for your DNA. And if I lose my DNA, no, this is only for the gun. This is all, that's all it is. All it is is that when they do the gun and they, they search for DNA, if they find DNA, right, they can say, okay, for sure it's him. Or for sure it's not him. Right? It's just a yeah, so it's just a reference. Because if, if not, then I have to apply for a search warrant, it's going to get a search warrant. And let's say even if I don't get it now, right, and it goes to the lab, once it comes back from the lab, they're going to say it's you because you're DNA is already in the system, like I said before. It's already in there, 100%. It's already in there. Right? So, when it comes back, they get DNA from the world. They've been taking DNA from, from convicted felons for, since, uh, since the best of my knowledge, probably. This officer is fishing right now at the same time, man. He's talking so much, so fast. Everything that he's trying to do is to convince homeboy to comply. That's it. You hear what he's saying, right? Like, he's not even really speaking the real facts or words, you know? Pay attention. That's before 2000. I think 1999 is when they started. When DNA became a thing. So. That's his whole card, it's DNA. <laughs> it's just real quick. He takes literally a swab of the inside of your mouth, and he's done. He puts in the thing, calls it a thing. <laughs> Yeah, ask for a lawyer, boy. Just oh, Smart. All right, just sit down real quick. Just swing your legs in there for me. Which phone is it going to be in? Uh, I talk to you, right? Yeah, my iPhone. That's the one that's on. You got another person in there with him? Am I tripping? Yeah. What, what am I looking at? Oh, that's him right there. That's his silhouette. I should have smoked a cigarette before I went in. So let's see what's going on right here. His charges are drug equipment, possess controlled substance without prescription, drug possession, controlled substance without, pres without prescription, possession of a weapon or ammo by a convicted felon. Mm mm mm. Uh, he ended himself with this one. You walk up mm mm mm. That turned out bad for old boy. You understand what I mean? With that being said, make sure you're out here doing the right thing. It doesn't pay as you see what he went through right there, right? Old boy should have just walked for lunch. You understand me? And then you going to work. Why are you bringing a hammer with you to work? Like, <laughs> what kind of ops you got at work? Maybe you need to look for a new job. You understand what I'm saying? Word. So with that being said, if you like what you saw, make sure you go in the comments, run it up, flood it up. Go ahead, like, comment, share, subscribe to the channel. It'll only help me grow further, all right? Let's go, baby. See you guys on the next one. Love.